I think it sort of encapsulates the season, really. You know, we've dominated the game. We've missed, we missed some unbelievable chances, and then we can't defend a set play for some reason. So, uh, you know, after that, then we missed another couple of great chances. It's, um, it's a head scratcher tonight for sure. We were totally dominant. We came up here, as I said before the, the, the game, we won 5 0. We didn't play nowhere near as well as we did tonight, um, and we got nothing for it. So, it's, um, yeah, it's a difficult one to stomach at the minute. Yeah, I could hear you shouting about urgency and get, trying to get that about the team. Was that a, a frustrating thing at the end when you were, you were losing one? Yeah, I just want to you know, keep the tempo up. And, um, but our decision making towards the end, well, at times in the game, our final ball, you know, we worked the ball into really good areas and we let ourselves down with the final ball. And the urgency to get on the end of crosses, you know, that's been lacking a lot this season as well. But we didn't play badly. You know, and um, I don't think we deserve to lose the game, but we have them. You said that encap encapsulates your season. Is this is that a bigger frustration? Then it's the same things. And when you are on a good run, a result like this is another bump in the road. Yeah, it's a bump. Yeah, but it's, you know, we're not learning from defending set players. You know, it's like Ross County maybe had the ball in our box once or twice in the in the second half, maybe the whole game, and um, you know we've conceded a, a free header. From the biggest guy in the team, who we should be dealing with, you know, comfortably. You're saying you're not learning. What can you do then? Well, it's been a bugbear, or it's been, um, it's certainly been a, a weak weakness of ours all season. You know, and I can't change it now. And we've a lot of, you know, players out, but you know, heading the ball is part of the game. Defending said players is part of the game. We have not done that anywhere near well enough this season. So we can tell them ad nauseum on the training ground, we can set them up ad nauseum, but you, you've got to go and want to head the ball in both boxes and we haven't done that well enough this season at all. How does that make you feel then if people aren't learning? Well, they're bitterly disappointed because they're good enough to learn or they don't want to, I don't know, maybe get hurt or throw their body in the way of things. And Yeah, it's, it's not good enough. From your point of view, Neil, any defeat with Celtic brings scrutiny. Do you feel that there'll be more on you again? There's been scrutiny on me all the time, you know, so I don't think that's going to change. But we, this is a result that, you know, it's happened, but we were in total control and we've missed, I mean, the chances we missed, particularly in the first half, were unbelievable. What do you say to the fans that are watching tonight that might be annoyed again? I'm sorry, you know, we've let them down again. Um, it's not for the want of trying to win a game of football. Um, so we're bitterly disappointed with that. Appreciate your time, Neil. Thank Cheers, you. thanks.